forehead and being a vlogger. I can just feel the judgment zooming down on my head. First of all, only God can judge me and thank you so much for pressing play on my channel. Oh, you want to talk about mothers making my way downtown walking fast. I'm sorry, that movie White Chicks is in my spirit. A St. Toast today. Um, but you know what? Good morning. How are you? I'm not singing the good morning song today. Maybe tomorrow. Oh, what the hell? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning today. How are you? First of all, let me say, hey, how you doing? Today, I hope that you are prepared to spend a little time with best friend today. Good morning. Do you hear the birds chirping to me? Good morning. Smell some of that beautiful God-given air. Good morning today. How are you? I hope that made you happy. If that made you happy, thumbs it up, okay? Second of all, you ever wake up and feel like you have something on your heart that needs to be expressed? Well, today was one of those days. I talked to a girlfriend last night and I felt like I was being really insensitive to her, but it took me to sleep it off and for the wine to wear off. <laughs> Girl, I'm just being honest. I'm just being honest, okay? Live your best life. And I really thought, you know what? I was being insensitive because I've been there before, meaning a divorce day, going through a divorce, and all of that jazz and it can be tough and the lack of understanding of time that it takes to heal from something like that most people don't know unless you go through and at that moment I felt like one of those people who had never been through it and I'm like hold on you've been there you know what it's like holiday time all this jazz especially if things happen in your relationship that really cause the deep breakdown into it I know this might go over some of y'all's head but the point is I was in sensitive because I told her well that's old mind you it's been like a year or in some change since whatever happened in their relationship and she said well it's not old to me I said well it's old and she was like well it's not old to me and then I really had to think about it and I called her this morning I said you know what after we talked about the kids and all this stuff and all that jazz how your mama doing with Thanksgiving making a turkey is you smoking it is you frying it or not I had to give her a very humble apology like you know what I was insensitive to your feelings you know I was giving time more credit then I was giving your feelings more credit to what you are going through because I've been there before so I should be a lot more understanding and have a little bit more you know sympathy as a woman to know what you're going through so if I can say this best friends don't expect people to do things how you would do it on your timing and heal the way that you would expect to heal people have to heal in their own time in their own way and just because you's a floozy and it only took you five days to get over somebody doesn't mean that the next person is going to do the same thing i'm just saying anyway this was a good talk um today it's the first day of the Thanksgiving holiday. Like I said, plans have changed for me and my family because the kids were supposed to go see their dad, but now they're not. And mommy is just gonna put the show on the road, honey. And I think today I'm gonna check my bank account because I got some money from this Dosh app. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna use that money to take my kids to the movies and maybe to a nice dinner, something fun, something kid friendly. So hey, thank you to everybody who signed up for the app. You can still sign up. And I don't know what the referral situation will be after what the 21st, but I know you sign if you sign up, you get ten dollars. Well, you get five dollars if you sign up, and then ten dollars for referring anybody who downloads the app. So thank you for everybody who did that. And you can still continue to download the app and get your $5 and get a referral kickback from it. Um, but I think it, it dropped, it bumps down to $5. Ha 
However, check it out. I'll leave the link in below. It's still free money, however you take it. Thank you, Lord Jesus. And you know what else I did this morning? I woke up this morning and immediately began to go into deep prayer. I said, thank you, Father God, for waking me up this morning, for putting love in my spirit. Create a clean and pure heart in me, oh God, today so that I can move forward and live my life in a Christ-like way. I'm just trying to love here. I'm just trying to love and, and, and spread love and not hate or anger. You know, sometimes you just got to be happy. Like that 80s song, Don't worry, be happy. And here's a little song I wrote. Do, do, do. Anyway, yeah. So, and have you thanked God today? That's all I'm asking you. Have you thanked God today? I thank God today. I thank, I thank God every day, but I really woke up and, um, and I just said, you know what, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for this day. I feel like my face is doing so much. Yes. Yes. Girl. Come on, let's that go. dip right there. That yeah. Dip. Oh, yeah, it will. It did. It will. It did. <laughs> Bless you. Okay, come on. Yes, we're going into sports clips to get these kids some haircuts. Oh my gosh, y'all. So Maximus, hold on, we gotta set this up. Maximus mixed breakfast. Maximus missed breakfast on account of him just being Maximus. He grabbed a Pop-Tart to go. It was unopened in an unopened box, y'all. And why did my son just bring this over to me? Girl, y'all, hold on. That is a whole moving bug. Please do not feed your kids Pop-Tarts. Do not do it. Oh my God. Oh my God. There's more in there. There's more inside. I'm so scared. I am so scared right now. I am so scared. They're like, did you, did you bite one Maximus? You sure? I won't tell anybody. It's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Oh my God. This is crazy. Do not feed your kids pop tarts, guys. I would, I wouldn't even. I'm not. Oh my gosh, mm, mm -mm. that is crazy. That was a. We pulled that like right out of the box. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Girl, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh. Oh my gosh. What the bug is that? Oh. that is crazy. It's it's um larva of some sort. Mm -hmm. And that's a shell. There's more than one. Izzy mm -hmm. loves bugs. Hold on. Hold on. It's a bug. That's like the larva shell. Mm. But there's one that's alive over here. It yeah, it was crawling. Mm. Oh Pop Tarts, y'all owe me an explanation for this. Mm. You want to see the bug, Izzy? <laughs> He's like a bug guy. Oh, gosh. Maximus, I am so sorry about that, baby. Oh, oh, it is alive and crawling. Look at this. Izzy, look at the bug. Come look at it. Come look at it. Look at that. Oh, that is crazy. Max First of all, that is completely insane that there was larva. Live larva. Larva, say it with your whole mouth. Larva inside of my son's Pop Tart. Pop Tart. Do you have part ownership with Capri Sun? Because we know we find nasty things in the bottom of Capri Suns. Help me out, you guys. I'm sorry. Best friend normally doesn't do this, but don't give your kids Pop Tarts. You don't know what's inside of that. That is crazy to me. Pop Tart. Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame on you. And don't be talking about, well, was it unopened? No, it was a closed, sealed package. It came out of a box. Out of the box, in the aluminum, shiny wrapper. And he was just chilling over here. 
waiting for his haircut. And he's like, mommy, I don't know what this is. Can I eat this? Cause he's all boys. So he's like, well, if it's moving, I need to ask my mom before I digest it. You know? No, you can't eat that. No, that's crazy. They're getting haircuts. If you guys are ever at, where we at? Sports Clips, make sure you come and see Miss Tika. Or Miss Sam. They've been cutting the boys' hair, you guys. They make them look so handsome. I asked Julian if he had a girlfriend. He said no. It wasn't that long on He's such a silly goose. Um, for real, for real though, I'm trying to like hold my composure up in this place and I, my boys have to get a haircut, you know, for the holidays so they can look nice for Thanksgiving. But I really am so upset about this pop talk. No. I am literally so upset about this pop tart. Like, I'm I'm upset. I really am. I, do you know how many pop tarts my kids have consumed from this box? Do you know how? how do you like pop tarts? He eats pop tarts like practically almost like every day out of this box that we bought. Yes. For another one? You have to say, please. He wants another lollipop. But yeah, guys, I'm I'm not happy about it. Like, I gotta go back and check the whole box now, but I would encourage you guys to never eat another Pop-Tart again. Yeah, go ask her, baby. And I'm just, that's just how I feel right now. I'm, I'm never eating another Pop-Tart. If I see you giving your child a Pop-Tart, I'm going to smack it out of your hand. I did, I said he could have another one. I'm just gonna walk up to you and smack it out of your hand. Just like, boop. Don't, don't, don't. Unless you're okay with your child possibly consuming maggots. That's just how I feel. That's just how I feel right now. Oh. On top of all of that, you guys, JoJo is not feeling well. She is shivering, shivering, shivering. She's been taking her antibiotics, but I'm probably going to have to take her back to the ER today because she's got some... to the kid house one? Yeah, baby. We're at Chick-fil-A now, you guys. Maximus. Okay, you're going to go play? Maximus was extremely hungry since he didn't get to have his pop tart. Again, we're never eating pop tarts ever again. This is why you have to watch your kids, okay? Because there's a little boy um, in the Chick fil A play area who just took his whole pair of pants off. Mind you, he can barely walk, okay? He can barely walk. He's not even a year old, but still. Watch your kids. Watch your kids. Y'all, I definitely am an 80s baby and I was raised in the 90s, okay? 
I don't know if you know what this is, but this is everything. If I let you borrow one of my cassette tapes, please return it, okay? Re rewind it with a pencil, whatever. And don't be messing up the tape inside either. Hey, you guys. I feel holiday-ish because you're in the stores, you're shopping around, hopefully you've locked your car doors because people ain't nice. Oh my gosh, look who we just ran into. It's Gigi. Santa. He's going up the ladder. Yeah, he's going up the ladder. I like this tree. It's very cute. He's going all the way up. Love it. What? What's that? What's now what is he doing? Going down. He sure is. That's pretty cool.